Effects of proteinases with metalloproteinase domains, MMPs, and atoms on tumor progression. Degradation of cell adhesion molecules, for example, E. cateran. By cutting intercellular adhesions, proteinases, symbolized by a pair of scissors, increase the motility and invasive growth properties of epithelial cells. Cleavage of membrane-bound growth factors, for example, members of the EGF family. Growth factors which are covalently linked to the plasma membrane are released. As a result, they can diffuse freely and reach their receptors on target cells. Mobilization of growth factors from the extracellular matrix, for example, TGF-beta. Growth factors may be trapped by components of the extracellular matrix. By degradation of such components, growth factors are released. Release of receptors, for example, FGF receptor 1. Growth factor receptors, which are released from the cell membrane, can no longer signal. They may act as traps for growth factors. Release of growth factors from binding proteins, for example, degradation of IGF binding proteins. Binding proteins which inhibit receptor binding of growth factors are degraded. Growth factors become active. Degradation of the basement membrane. Proteinases assist tumor invasion by degrading the basement membrane, which is indicated in red. Subsequently, tumor cells can penetrate blood and lymphatic vessels. Release of bioactive fragments from the extracellular matrix, for example, endostatin and tumstatin. Cleavage products from the extracellular matrix may exert biological activity. Endostatin is derived from collagen 18 and tumstatin from collagen 4. These fragments inhibit angiogenesis.